crazy day in the world of GTA because we're taking 24 <laughs> people and playing undercover cops versus bandits. Now, I'm not positive, but looking at the image, it looks oddly familiar. And that's strange because my brain doesn't remember a lot of things. So that being said, I think we've played it before. If we haven't, then it's new. It's good. It's cool. And if we have, then let's just pretend for my sake, guys. I'm losing my memory at a fast rate here. Oh, well, let me hit play. Player joining, please. Wait, wait. <laughs> Uh. Boom! Hit that like button while we're waiting. And boom! Check out my Florida Dragon shirts. I'm just a crazy man riding on an alligator. Gotta love it. I never washed this. <laughs> hey, we all got on the same team. It's crazy! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what, what's wrong? Yeah. Nothing. It's what drum? I was, I was just startled. That's all. <laughs> oh, why? Oh, oh. Uh. It's a smiley face. So, oh. Cappy, let's get down to brass tacks here. Last night we were cooking, and he wouldn't let me put toothpaste in the quesadilla. Ew. Why do you keep no trying to put toothpaste in things that toothpaste doesn't belong? He, he keeps saying this stuff, but I can't do egg in a bag. <laughs> Wait, yeah, hold on. You can't. Wait, what is egg in a bag? It's a disgrace. <laughs> you wanted the bologna oh. spread in the... No, pasta. Matt, get out of my car. Why is someone in my car? Get your own car, guy. He jumped Matt. out. Yo, Matt, are we there yet? No, Matt, get out. Are we I, there yet? Uh, I Matt, the get out. The aren't gonna have a chance. Are we there yet? Matt, get out. Yep, yeah, got one. Matt. I got Zach, Dad. <laughs> God, why do I keep getting hit by people? Dropsy wouldn't even drive because I was in her car. I got another. Oh, These poor had a weird souls. In your car. Oh God! I take them where they're going so they get out. These guys don't stand a chance. Oh, it's invisible. One's it's garbage. One's pretty far. Like I said, not a chance, Dropsy. Right. Oh man, JD over there saying he had steak for breakfast, my man. That's what's up. Even back I when I used to eat meat, I never actually had steak for. I always saw it on like breakfast menus, but I never bothered having it. I was like, why not just have like bacon? Steak and eggs and bacon. eggs and steak. Oh, that guy enjoys his haircut. That's what I had for breakfast. Oh, oh my oh! god. <laughs> I'm not sure I just... <laughs> That was the most intense thing I've ever done in GTA. I hit the guy by literally his hair, but it just completely got him. Oh, that guy thought he was safe on that. And no, Apparently sir. Apparently he is. Well, no, I just drilled it as friend. I got one of the two. You can't eat them all. Why does this car not have jets come out the back? This guy looking for a tussle? All right, if this is what you want, and this is Look how you want it to go road. down, Matt! Sorry, Jerome, but I've been trying to hit him for a while, and you took too long. <sighs> you weren't taking that glory from me, buddy. No <laughs> honor. You have no honor. No mm -hmm. honor. How long until you think the HOA would be all over me if I had a cow living on my immediately. balcony? Immediately. I think it's <laughs> not immediately. Yeah. No, you definitely get away with it for too long. No, yeah. there's no I way. If you got a cow oh, in the lobby into the elevator. Ow. I mean, there's definitely ways I could sneak it in, but like... Don't worry. <laughs> the brain soft Jordan says a tablecloth there for the cow. <laughs> I Dude, look no, I have half Matt, right now. Matt, what do I look dumb? He'd have a trench coat, obviously. Ow. I just immediately got wiped out. Me too. <laughs> Matt, obviously the cow would have a trench coat. Ah! Be a, another cow on top of him so he looks tall enough to get into the movie. Yeah, Ooh. obviously, man. What do you, what do you think this is, first grade? <laughs> this is impossible. I mean, this is my first rodeo, my first time sneaking a cow into one of the buildings. Yes. <laughs> I I haven't heard the story if it's not your first rodeo. Nah! But would Blech. you doubt that I've done it? No. No. I tried to buy a goat one time, but that didn't work out. Steve, you goats. know if you bought a cow before you bought a llama, you'd be in serious trouble. Yeah. The most exotic pet I've ever owned was an albino queen snake. That oh, sounds nice. awesome. It was pretty awesome. It was uh, just for a Boy Scout thing. We were doing like an exotic pet takeover, but my sister put like a paper airplane in the enclosure and it got loose. Oh no, did it fly the plane? Yes. Absolutely. We don't need flying snakes, dude. Snakes wait, did, on a plane? Wait, did you know there's actually a snake that can glide? Stop. I was gonna say, those yeah. are a thing. Full stop. Yeah. They, they climb trees. I forgot about and this. Glide. Please stop. And they just like wiggle in the air and they just like <laughs> wiggle, glide. Wiggle, wiggle. Can I tell you guys a, a, a ghost story, a horror story from my childhood? Did you I have mean, did a, a wiggling a snake spider. attack you? I had a pet spider and I fed it all kinds of insects and stuff and it grew up big and strong. And then one day it had like a zillion little spiders on its butt. So uh -oh. I was too grossed out to ever go near it again. But then I went out back on my porch and I found out that spiders, when they have their babies, they like 
Wait. poop out a little piece of web and they parachute into the real world. Yeah. So there was like thousands of parachuting baby spiders coming off my deck and I walked out back and they were just like floating towards me. Are we runners? Oh no, there's a girl. What, Matt? I am so yeah, confused. You didn't learn that from Charlotte's Web? I oh, learned it from car. the baby spider that pooped out. Who took Dude, my car? Steven, you ran like past four cars to get here. I know, but that's Play the same thing. But I'm just, time. no, I'm more, I'm I'm cons uh, the, the story just confuses me. So was it actually like in a cage of pet spider or did you just find yes. a spider on it? So then how to get on the back porch? In the cage. It oh, was the on my back porch. I kept it outside. Oh, okay. That's smart. Yeah, I don't want the spider inside, Jerome. Okay, that yeah, expl so that explains a lot. That okay, so because the, the part I was curious about is how it just spontaneously became pregnant, um, and then <laughs> and then I, I, just had I think it was already when I called it. I assume. Uh, okay, I mean it could have also know. a spider could have broken into the cage, right? That's true. I think I'm gonna kill Zach Chad just by okay or not. Spiders just give me the heebie-jeebies, honestly. Some of them are cute, like tarantulas. You know, back this just goes to show you that the '90s were a wild time. I had a uh, I had a, a pet snake, and by that I mean I went in the backyard and I caught a Gartner snake, or at least we thought it was. We didn't really know anything about snakes, but I caught it. And then for show and tell, my teacher let me bring it into class. This wild snake that I had caught. We had nice. no paperwork, nothing, and that that was just the '90s, really. Don't camp. <laughs> Don't camp. All right, I'll go to the end and get a tank. That way, no, Matt, to you're gonna. You're gonna make it impossible for oh, anyone else. God. I was You're very sad. Impossible. That was the shortest ownership of a pet I ever had. We had to let him go. Those snakes don't eat in captivity, so every time we tried to feed no, it stuff, it don't. just wouldn't eat. And eventually, after like a couple days, my mom's like, "Well, we gotta let him go, buddy." And I was like, "But, but, 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 but," and so we let him go. And presumably, he's the size of a house did she say now. Buddy, or did she say soupy? Probably the soupy. What? What? He's what? What? No. The size what? of a house? Yeah, what? snake. It's definitely the size of a house now. No. They grow exponentially. Every year, snakes triple in size. I don't yep. want none of that, Anaconda. Eventually, it turns into trees. That's how we get trees. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Trees are just snakes, Dropsy. I didn't realize. Mm -hmm. Steve, were you with us that one time we were running through the woods in the, the rainstorm and then the whole tree was spiked? Yes, and the whole tree moved. Oh my goodness, yes. What? What do you mm -hmm. mean the tree moved? What? Well, so we were running through the woods. We like to like run through the creek. And okay. like We call it rock rock jumping, I believe. And we just basically jump between boulders and like along the creek and see how far down the creek we could get. So it started to rain really bad. And I guess all the spiders that were in the leaves and stuff were like, ah, we got to get out of this rain. So they ran up the trees. Well, Parkour. this one tree was just like wolf spiders, which if you're familiar, they're kind of like mini tarantulas. Oh, no. Um, and we were walking across this log that went across the water. And then we go to like lean our hand on Jeez, the tree to I like get our stuff. And then the whole tree moved away from our hand because it was covered in spiders. Ooh. Oh. It was terrifying, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Oh. And there was this time my brother didn't believe me it was a snapping turtle. <laughs> and then I poked it with a stick and it swam away like a prehistoric creature. <laughs> boogie, oogie, oogie, I'm boogie lucky. everywhere. Snappy, snapping turtles, you can get hurt a lot. Yep. And they are definitely dinosaurs. Yeah. Just like chimkins. Mm-hmm. Oh. What a what a weird thing! Like man now consumes dinosaurs more than any other animal. Oh. Parkour. Oh. Do you think, being I live in Florida, you can go outside and catch a lizard oh. and eat it? Yeah, there's so many lizards here. We have um, I think they're called them? skinks. I would not you, eat them. You could, but I wouldn't. People eat cicadas, but lizards on a stick. Oh. Fail. Can we make oh lizard my. quesadillas? Ah. <sighs> Vale, we'll make lizard quesadilla. I'm busy, Jerome! <laughs> <laughs> okay, but lizard quesadilla. <laughs> only ra only rattlesnakes. <laughs> oh Wait, my god! Not. Now I'm thinking, what if all lizards were like miniature alligators? So like you have these little tiny things and they like clamp down with a big sharp jaw. So basically they just go around and this people be people Florida would just be people losing their toes left and right. You'd be walking yeah. the street and watch them, and then your your pinky toe would just be gone. What the? Get them toes, Matt. That's all I'm saying. 
I'm so confused about what's going on with our cars back here. I don't know. All right, now. No one else is afraid of these mini chomping alligators. No, no, not I've really. I've seen little baby alligators, and they don't seem so bad. I think they would eat your toes, Matt. I don't. Given think the opportunity, would. they would bite it clean off. I'm more terrified of crawfish. Crawfish what? don't eat toes, Matt. And they certainly do. You've certainly never ran through a creek if you don't think crawfish eat toes. Here's a novel idea. Don't run through creeks. Here's a novel idea. What kind of childhood do you have as a kid if you got a creek and you ain't running Wait, through it? Wait, one without soggy socks. Also, you had crawfish in your creeks up in Maryland? Um, New I don't Jersey, know they were, we had they were, nothing um, They, I don't know if they were crawfish. There was something else. Crayfish. Oh. Crayfish. <laughs> oh man. In New Jersey, we had Did nothing fun in our streams. Crayfish are like crawfish. They're very similar. You were lucky if you found like tadpoles in the little creeks and streams where I lived. I think I just ramped it off of Zach Chad's head. Yep. Zach Chad is now spectating. Um, so yeah, we had crayfish. We had um, a bunch of different little fish. Snakes. Um, we had snapping turtles. We had box turtles. We had lots of little frogs to, to catch. Pollywogs. Um, yeah, polywogs are just tad they're just tadpoles, polywogs. I recently yeah. found that out they're the exact same thing. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. I never knew that people called them polywogs until like a month or two ago. I call them polywogs because it's fun. <laughs> is this guy not going or where is he down? I think he's AFK. Alright, let's get on the platform and use our flare yep, guns. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, is he up there? He's up there. We gotta yeah, go to the end. Up. We gotta go to the end and try and cheat. Or is this the map that's perfectly made where you can't cheat? Because some maps are like that. Yeah. Well, even this guy's in the way, so I can't make the jump onto the... I'm just gonna go climb into the platform and get it. That's him. what I tried to do, but somebody instantly pushed me off. I'm assuming this guy said, oops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dang. Uh, who is it? <laughs> Uh, Asher. Uh, oh, Asher may have had connection problems. Yeah, he lives in South yeah. Africa, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he definitely had connection yep. problems. Do you believe in magic? In the young Steve's heart. Steve in the way Steve walks around and always fucks. Farts. Yeah, and so. That's called drop dusting. See, was it you that. <laughs> and if he yeah. was a geographer, he'd work with charts. Do, 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 do. Was it Steve that taught me that when you snap your fingers, you're really just punching your thumb with your finger? Yeah. yeah your your, your, your no, finger that you're right. using against your thumb smacks your palm. Yeah. That? Smacks my thumb. <laughs> Dude, he died! He jumped from the top of the, the running pad and just slammed into the fence. <laughs> he just, he, Dude, this he, fence is yeah. impossible to get over. That's why he did it. Go, 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 go. Come on. I want to make it to at least the first boundary, please. You know what makes it impossible is when the ah. cars camp. Like, if the cars always had the gas pedal pressed down, this would be a lot more interesting. Yeah. I could not agree more with you. Oh, oh my well, God, Steve. Go. You survived a lot before that this happened. This is the furthest I've made it, guys. I'm so proud. I'm so I'm proud. So no, proud no, don't fall. You. Oh, my God, yes. Bruh. Drum, you got this. Drum, you got this. If the cars weren't enough, this guy's driving slowly alongside the track, lighting me on fire with a flare gun. Oh, just normal Wednesday things. Got it. <laughs> yep. Just another man. <laughs> Chat keeps saying Mount Marty. <laughs> they want Mount Marty. No, it's they not. Want Mount Marty. It hasn't been first a month. First person only. No, you're insane if you want first person only Mount Marty. Uh -huh. I, I played that. It sucked. Yeah, we did it on a stream, and that is not fun. <gasps> Drum, get up, buddy. Drum, get up. Drum, get up, buddy. Get in the cage. Get in the cage, Morty. Okay, there we go. It's the raging Cajun. Drum is our mule. I'm on fire. Actually, Drum, it might have been worth your time to climb up, because I don't think they can jump that high. Yeah, all right, now, Drops. Oh. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> She's inflating. Yeah, Drum. <laughs> oh, Colin didn't jump. Oh, no. Oh, God. Colin, no. Oh, my God. Wait, Matt, you're still alive? Oh, my God. Come Let's on, Matt. There. You can survive. 
Let's see if these powers really still exist. Sameth, you got this, buddy. There's no way anything could go possibly wrong at all. Oh, well, he, oh, um, like he just stopped. He's like, I'm not doing this now. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, nope, not happening. Nope. Nah, fam. Not I, today. I kind of like his outfit, though. Yeah, very fancy. Oh, well, he's on fire. Oh, he's definitely, he's most well, certainly on fire. Well, <laughs> wow. <laughs> that's one way to get him. I don't like when it calls me a loser. I wish it said not winner. That sounds like loser talk. That sounds like participation <laughs> medal. I recently found out how much you can get customized trophies for. It's not as much as I thought. Like, I got, I got a customized pigeon trophy. I was going to say, are you going to talk about the pigeon? Yeah, that thing was like 20 bucks, maybe. I was kind of surprised. Got one. Yay. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not going to go out and start buying trophies all the time, although maybe. But, like, I was still very surprised. It was only 20 bucks for, like, a single I'm going to make a trophy room, and I'm going to get all these extravagant trophies, but they're going to say the most ridiculous things. I think that's a good idea. I, uh... They will be like, wow, what is this for? And I'm like, ah. Oh, wow. well, this, was, uh, this is my trophy for the most extravagant trophy room. <laughs> Voted most likely to have a receding hairline at 28. That's, that's what I want a trophy <laughs> for. I, uh, got best in show in Rodeo Art once. Drum, we can only in hope. That just opens the door for art? more sponsors. You don't know about Rodeo Art? No, I, no, I, I do. That's why I was like, oh. Because I, I used to go to rodeos when I was younger. Oh, yeah, I participated in Rodeo Art every year. Did you get a trophy? Yeah. I was going to say, trophy. otherwise it didn't happen. But okay, cool. So he uh, has proof. Matt, you never won any Pinewood Derbies. <laughs> <laughs> I, oddly enough, I actually have a first place Pinewood Derby trophy. Oh no. Did everyone here do some form areas. of Boy you, Scouts or you, Girl Scouts? You, you, I did Boy Scouts like Scouts. two years maybe. I say, because I did Girl Scouts and uh, Campfire. It got old quick because they started, it started being like school where they give you like homework and stuff more yeah. or less. And I was like, no, I, I already have school for this. <laughs> I'm good. I'll I don't pass. need to learn. <laughs> yeah. I did not come here to read. Head, What's you, up? I already dropped that car on your head. You think I uh, can't be me? To... Stop! Who's AFK now? Leave! What's wrong? Man! No! You're going off the edge. No! <laughs> Do it. What is he doing? He's just trying to knock me off the edge of the map! Oh no, I meant where's this last guy? Uh, I don't know. Steve and I are playing our own minigame. Yeah, we were. I think he's definitely AFK. Uh-huh. Welcome to the show. And he left! GG! We won two rounds by default. I'll take it.